That's the alarm for the methane gas! Ah, oh, damn it! Fumes were all over the place. I was starting to feel dizzy. Then, I fell into the puddle of animal feces! Ah! Crap! I gotta get out of here! Fast! I'm here at Fumi Satake. Mr. Grand, let's take lunch! So, I work for a training company. I was at a sewage plant in Germany for a business trip. Recently, I sold some water treatment equipment to this facility, but... Ha! Ah, that smells! Huh? Oh, sorry! I got some dirty water on my clothes this morning! You got to be careful! It smells terrible! I've been here for two weeks now. The place smelled terrible. There were sewage plants all over the world. I checked the digestion tank. All clear! Good! They used microorganisms to break down and treat sewage. This plant was looking for some new equipment, so I introduced some new models to them. I was helping them with installing the new equipment. Ah, looking good. Mr. Satake, thank you for everything. The transition is going really smoothly. Good to hear. Things were going pretty well. Then a few days later, all clear. What happened there? Oh, just burnt myself. I was using the iron. No big deal. I was out in the plant, inspecting the new equipment. I was paired up with Mr. Grand that day. My wife and I just had a baby, so gotta help out with the housework, you know? Ah, I see. Congratulations. His hand was injured, so I carried the bucket for him. We needed it to collect some samples. The digestion tank was filled with waste. The stench was atrocious. Ugh, that smells disgusting. Don't puke in the bucket now. I'll be fine. I felt like throwing up. The digestion tank was filled with microorganisms. Ugh. So I had to get some samples to make sure the equipment was working properly. It was nearly 100 degrees Fahrenheit in the tank. I was sweating like crazy. Ah, it stinks. And it's so hot. Almost now. It was so hot. The smell was killing me. But then I started to feel all dizzy. Then the alarm started going off. That's the alarm for the methane gas. We gotta go. What? There was a methane gas leak. This was bad. Mr. Gran was starting to feel dizzy too. Oh! Crap! Crap! Then... Oh! Ah! Mr. Gran fell over towards me. We lost our balance. Then... Ah! Ah! We fell head first into the digestion tank. Ah! 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 I was feeling dizzy, but the terrible smell moved me right up. I was sinking fast. Crap! I gotta get up there! It was so dark in there. I tried my best to swim up to the light. The tank was filled with waste and microorganisms. Crap! I gotta go! I'm gonna die if I stay in here! I tried to swim, but I was barely moving. I could feel the feces entering my system through my mouth and nose. Ah! I don't want to die! The light was getting smaller. My body was sinking lower and lower. But I wasn't ready to give up. Ah! I'm not dying here! I moved as fast as I could. The other workers were calling for help. Tuzwaka just fell in the digestion tank. Get help! Everyone started to panic. Then, as they were getting ready to rescue us, ah! Mrs. Satake! You made it! I managed to pull myself out of the tank. Mrs. Satake, you're okay. Thank goodness you're alive. Ugh, that stinks! Mr. Grand is still in there! I was covered in feces, so I still had to go to the hospital. But for now, I'm safe. Around the same time, at the Central Command Center... Start the digestion tank! What? How's that going to help? Just do it! And call 911! No! They were working hard to rescue Mr. Grand, but they couldn't just shut down the plant. We can't help him with all that sewage! The only way is to empty the tank! That's impossible! If we stop the plant, the city will overflow with sewage in no time! He was right. If they shut down the plant, the city would be covered in sewage. Finding him in the tank wasn't gonna be easy. Ah! He's in there? Please help him! Mr. Grand! Ah! The rescue team came, but they couldn't find him. An hour later, we found him. He was stuck at the bottom of the tank. His body was starting to bubble. The microorganisms started decomposing his body. Then, 48 hours later... Wait! What is that? Huh? It's a body! We found his body in the secondary digestion tank. We pulled him out, but... No! 
Mr. Grand! Oh dear! We couldn't even recognize him anymore. The director of the plant lost his job over the accident. Mr. Grand! And many of the employees were traumatized. Most of them quit after the accident. I was hospitalized for a few days, but I was fine. It was time for me to go home. I still can't get the image of his decomposed body out of my head. I know I gotta move on, but it's gonna take some time. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to check out our other videos. And please subscribe to the channel.